Shalom, Barakatah Yahweh, Barakatah Yahweh Shah, Barakatah Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shah, Waha, Raka, Kodesh, double honor to the apostles and elders, a great millstone, the men who taught me this truth, peace and blessings to the hopeful elect that's doing the work of the only savior of the elect of the nation of Israel, Yahweh Shai, and all fear, Shalom. And our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai, is the only route to eternal life. The only way that we're going to receive eternal life is through our Lord and our Savior, Yahweh Shai. This is um, St. John, chapter 14, and verse 6. And it reads, Yahweh Shai said unto him, and that him is Thomas, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. So the only way that you're going to receive um, clearance in that day of judgment is through our Lord and our Savior, Yahweh Shai. All right. Only way that you're going to receive clearance to enter into eternal rest. To, to receive salvation is through our Lord and our Savior, Yahweh Shah, and not by your own accord, not by any other wayward doctrine that these devils of the world um, can give to you. The only way that we're going to receive eternal life if we subscribe to Yahweh Shah, put all our faith in Yahweh Shah, and we have received Yahweh Shah through a mixture of faith, all right, because we have the gift of faith from the Most High, pursuant to the book of Ephesians, chapter 2 and verse 8, all right? And that's the only men that have um, grasped on eternal life right now or, or walking on the path to eternal life. The men that believe in our Lord and our Savior, Yahweh Shah, all right? Yah meaning he, Yahweh Shah means uh, save or deliverance because that's the only way that we're going to be saved or delivered. This is Isaiah 53 and verse 1. Who have believed our report? And to whom is the arm of the Lord, Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shah, revealed? All right. Who has uh, Yahweh Shah been manifest unto or brought to light? All right. Or, or became for us to know. Okay. And to follow. Is the men here at Great Millstone, starting with the head apostles, the men that have the true faith upon the earth. Because we believe the report. We believe the coming of a savior that sprang out of Judah, which makes him a so-called modern day black man by the name in the Paleo Hebrew, Yahweh Shah, which means he delivered. All right. We believe the report. And that's the true path to eternal life. First John chapter five and verse 10. He that believed on the son of the most high or the Son of God, which says here in the scripture, and who is that? Our Lord and our Savior, Yahweh Shah, the only begotten Son of the Most High. He, have, he that have believed, all right, how do we believe? Through faith. On the Son of the Most High have the witness in himself. He that believeth not the Most High have made him a liar, because he believeth not the record that the Most High gave of his son. Yes, and we uh, are not making the Most High a liar because we believe the report, all right? That's why we're going out being a witness, all right? Lord willing, we be a part of that number that walked with Yahweh Shai, all right? That that seen Yahweh Shai and believed Yahweh Shai in the ancient times, all right? Thus making us the witnesses here in these modern times to go out and to tell the world the coming of a savior, all right, the, 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 the coming of the way of eternal life, which is our Lord and our Savior, Yahweh Shah. Uh, 1 John 5 and 11, and this is the record that the Most High have given to us, and that us are who? The ones that believe eternal life. And this life is in his Son. All right, that's the only way that, that you shall receive eternal life is through Yahweh Shai, which is the son, the only begotten son of the Most High. And let's prove that. This is uh, St. John chapter 1 and verse 4. 
in him, and that him is our Lord and our Savior, Yahweh Shah, was life. All right. And that life is not just the average life that everybody else walking around here uh, proclaiming to have. Just because uh, they're walking around and they're breathing, that doesn't mean that they're alive. We, we're speaking of the, the eternal life. All right. Because they're, they're going to get destroyed on this side. All right. Two thirds are going to get destroyed on this side, but they're going to come back in the kingdom through Yahweh Shai giving uh, eternal life to the elect. All right. First John one and three, all things were made by him and without him was not anything made that was made. Verse four in him was life and the life was the light of men. And we are the only ones that have that light. And that light is what the understanding. All right understanding the way to salvation, which is Yahweh Shah, understanding the mysteries uh, uh, of this deep, dark secret, all right? If anything is deep and dark, you need to share what? Light. And Yahweh Shah is that light. So let's go back to St. John. It's like it. First John chapter 5 and verse 11. And this is the record, all right? That the Most High have given us eternal life. And that's, that us, once again, starting with the head apostles here at Great Millstone, all right, to the elders on down to younger brothers like myself, and even anybody, all right, that's a part of the elect number outside of Great Millstone that subscribe to this truth, all right, and Yahweh, why Yahweh shot, all right? Read known in First uh, John 5 and 11, and this life is in his son. And we just proved that, all right, with, uh, uh, St. John 1, uh, chapter 1 and verse 4, all right? 1 John 5 and 11, he that have the Son have life, all right? Let's get a quick precept. This is um, Hebrews chapter 3 and verse 14. For we are made partakers of of a Mashiach, if we hold the beginning of our confidence steadfast unto the end. Yeah, that's right, because uh, we have eternal life right now, all right? But uh, uh, St. Matthew chapter 24 says what? He that endureth unto the end, the same shall be saved, all right? So Hebrews 3 and 4 says, for we are made partakers of a Mashiach, all right? Joint as if we hold the beginning of our confidence steadfast until the end all right so, which meaning if we believe like we did in, in the beginning all the way up into the end and the end is, uh, is 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 coming about all right when those thermonuclear missiles okay be shot on america if we hold fast our confidence in yahweh Shah, which is the way to eternal life steadfast until the end let's jump back to first john Chapter 5 and verse 12 again. He that he that have the son have life. Alright? And he that have not the son have not life. Alright? And these Christians, all right, these two thirds that's caught up in this Christianity, these two thirds that's 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 caught up in this Jarastafariism, all right, that think they're Muslims, Moors, Kemet. You don't have Yahweh Shah, which meaning you don't have life, okay? Life meaning life eternal, okay? But like I said, once again, two-thirds are going to come back in the kingdom only through the ones that are predestinated to receive eternal life, which is the elect of the nation of Israel. Lord willing, we be a part of that number, all right? First John chapter 5 and verse 13, these things have I written unto you, that believe on the name of the Son of the Mosiah. That's right. When we receive these letters, all right, we believe through a mixture of faith because we believe the report, all right? These things that, that the prophets of old have written, uh, well, Hebrews 15 and 4, things that was written aforetime was written for our learning, see? So let's read verse 13 again. These things have I written unto you that Believe on the name of the Son of the Most High. And we are the, the believers waking up here, just like you got these, these Sodomites waking up, all right? These 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 Luciferians waking up. We are the believers of old that, that are waking up, all right? Read known that ye may know that ye have eternal life, 
All right. How do we know that we have uh, eternal life? Because what? We believe on the son of the most high, which is our Lord and our savior. All right. Let's get a um, matter of fact. Let's keep reading. It says. That ye may know that ye have eternal life and that ye may be, and that ye and that ye may believe on the name of the son of the most high. All right. And, and, and we believe on the name. All right. Of the son of the most high, because that's the only name. All right. That, that, that we should be saved by the only name that, that we should be saved by the name of uh, the only begotten son, Yahweh Shai. All right. And um, what is that? Acts 4 and 12. All right. Let's see. Can we get that? Um, the book of Acts. Chapter 4. And verse 12. Neither is there salvation in any other. All right. In any what? Any other what? Name. For there is none other name under heaven, what's under heaven, the earth, given among men, whereby we must be saved. And what's that name? Yah, meaning he, Hawashah, meaning save, meaning deliverer. Yahawashah, all right? The only way that, that we're going to be saved. And to be saved is to what? To reap eternal life, which is the kingdom that shall be set up upon earth, man, all right? And we read it from the top of the lesson. Let's read it one more time. Um, St. John. Uh, 14 and verse 6. Yahweh Shai said unto him, and once again that him is Thomas, I am the way, the truth, and the life. He is the way uh, uh, to eternal life. He is the truth, all right, of the matter, and he is the life. All right, which we read in, in uh, St. John chapter one and verse four. He is the life, which is the light of men. And those the light of men are the elect of the nation of Israel. It says, no man cometh unto the father, which is the most high, Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, but by me. All right. So Yahweh Shai, at the end of the day, is the only way to eternal life. Through Yahweh Shai, we shall reap eternal life if we hold steadfast. All right. Our, our, our faith, if we hold our faith unto the end, uh, St. Matthew chapter 24, he that endureth unto the end, the same shall be saved, and we shall be saved only through Yahweh Shah. Lord willing, I pray that this been edifying, Barakat the Yahweh, Barakat the Yahweh Shah, Barakat the Yahweh, Barakat the Yahweh Shah, Barakat the Yahweh, Barakat the Yahweh Shah, call Halayim Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah, Waha Raka Kodash. Double honor to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone, the men who taught me this truth. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect that's doing the work of our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai, and all fear shall awarn to his elect.